Hi, I'm Riccardo Romani. I first became aware of the Iraqi Boxing National Team in 2014 while I was in Baghdad covering the war as a journalist. I was so taken by the dramatic story, we decided to make a documentary film. This is a story of a group of kids growing up surrounded by war. The first Gulf War, then the Liberation War, now the Sectarian War. This is a story of a group of young men who keep fighting for their dream, and their dream is to be part of the Olympics in Rio 2016. <laughs> I was in Baghdad last time in uh, October 2014, uh, covering the uprising of ISIS. They had boxing team preparing for the Olympics uh, without even having a gym, because apparently it was destroyed by some bombing or some car bombing. They were sharing small bottle of water. They didn't have uh, gloves. They were sharing gloves. There was a guy working without the gloves, just like doing like uh, uh, meets. And they had a couple of teacher and plus the coach, who is an older guy. <laughs> the thing that really strikes me, beside the appearance of these kids, using a wall as a punching bag, hurting themselves in a way, was the discipline. <laughs> and the dedication. I'm going to take a look at the camera. I'm going فطلعت ظليت مدة شهرين هناك قاتلت والحمد لله وشكر رجعت وبيضة وجع لا فرق بين كردي وسنية وشيء عربة ما كويس Boxing and soccer are the main vehicle for kids to escape. If I think of what a kid has to face daily, like several checkpoints, the risk of being victim of a car bombing, whatever, to reach the training camp, fighting against all possible odds <laughs> in order to survive and to express himself. I think this is a great message, and no matter what, how far they can go into qualification process, no matter how many kids they will reach the Olympics in Rio, this is a real victory.